Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is of course Jack and this is Lumber Tycoon 2. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be doing something a little different. Um, well, a little different other than the fact that it's in Lumber Tycoon, I suppose. Um, and we are going to be going ahead and getting Glowwood or the um, Glow Firwood, which is also the yellow wood. Um, and we're going to be doing it, I'm going to be showing you how to do it, in under seven minutes. Um, now, so many people complain that they can't get this or that they die every time they go to get it. So, I thought I'd go ahead and show you the best way that I found to do it, um, which is under seven minutes. So, here we go. So, I'm going to time myself uh, just to make sure that it is under seven minutes because otherwise then that's going to be a bit embarrassing and I'll have to obviously change it to whatever time it is. Um, so, yeah. So, the first thing is, of course, I'm doing this in a public server. So, any lag or anything that I may experience that you may experience if you do this in a public server, then I'm going to have as well. Um, also, I need an axe. That might be... Oh, hang on. I think I might have left one over there. Okay. I did actually um, already come here, come over here and then realised that I wasn't recording, uh, which is great. So, uh, bear with while I just go and respawn the vehicle that was over there, because otherwise that's going to be in my way. There we go. So, we used to have it... So, the, um, uh, the tailgate was open at the back. However... I haven't done that for like a couple of days now. Um, as you can see, I have been stocking up on yellow wood over there. Not that I really need it, um, just for the sake of having it, I suppose. So anyway, first thing you're going to want to do, reverse off the back here. That's going to either land you up the right way, or it's going to land you up the wrong way, whichever. And if you die, then you're just going to have to go and try again. It does take a little bit of patience, a little bit of skill. I don't know what skill you need to do it, but yeah, it, I think it's mostly luck, really. Uh, it depends what angle that you drive into the actual water as well. Um, all of these are dependent factors. I've just realised that I've forgotten to start recording. Not record. Starting to <laughs> Forgotten to start um, the timer, which is a bit embarrassing. So again, I'm going to have to reset. I've just done exactly the same thing that I did last time. That was not the best <laughs> tool. Oh well. Okay. So... Obviously, remember your axe because your axe is quite an important factor in this. I've also bring a t yeah, bought a Twitter axe. Um, it's not the best axe in the game at all, but I wanted to factor in obviously that not everybody has. Um, uh, oh, whoa! That was some serious lag. There we go. See, I'm doing it with lag, so you can't say that it was unfair. Um, I've also obviously bought a Twitter axe because I could have bought a mini axe and had it cut really quick. However, obviously not everybody owns a mini axe. Not everyone can afford a mini axe, so that would be unfair. So I've tried to make this as fair as, I, as possible as I can. Um, and that has obviously involved bringing a Twitter axe. Instead, I could have bought a Ruthie axe, I suppose, but I think the Twitter axe is probably actually worse than the Ruthie axe, so it might be just about the same. So it probably doesn't matter too much. Um, according to my timer or stopwatch, whatever, I can't get, can't think of the right one. I'm at 1 minute 13 seconds right now. Um, and I'm waiting for my health to come up in the corner here. Obviously because the water damages you. Um, and obviously you don't really want to get damaged. So um, Now I cut it fine, but I know when it's, when it's safe for me to go. So if you're new to doing this, if you've not done this route before then maybe you want to wait until your health has gone fully back up to full health. That might be better for you. Um, like, I almost died then, but I knew that I wasn't going to die because I timed it, like, or not timed it. I, I know the timings of how, me how much health you can lose in between the two um, platforms, stops, things, thingies. So, yeah. And then I can do... Uh, this only takes two damage or two lots of damage off your health here, so you can probably go with about half. We've just hit two minutes on the clock. I'm still waiting, still waiting, still waiting. And obviously, if you want to get like loads of yellow wood, then you can do that with this method as well. Um, it does involve using the uh, the glitch, which allows you to walk up walls. Um, but you do that with the wood itself. So, you know, this is how to get it not using the eyeball. Um, that's a very small uh, tree right there. Uh, not using the eyeball, not using uh, any exploits, anything like that. It's just a simple glitch that Default here is aware of um, and that is pretty cool and that, you know, I suppose we should take advantage of while it's in the game. Um, and of course, if anyone doesn't know what this area is, this is a memorial to um, a uh, number tycoon 2 YouTuber who sadly passed away uh, during... March 2018 I think 
Um, her name was Rebecca, um, or Tic Tac Twerk, which was her uh, YouTube um, channel name. Um, and you can go ahead and check out the um, tribute video that I did for her, or did um, for the memorial, um, which was a couple of weeks ago. Um, and yeah, it's only a couple of minutes long, so you know, if you have a bit of time, then you can go ahead and watch it. Okay. I don't need much yellow wood, so I'm going to grab a couple of pieces, and then we will go back to um, uh, back to my base. And just as a respect, obviously, because I am taking ticks wood, like you know, I'm not saying you have to. I just think it's a respectful. I'm going to leave my axe there for her. So there we go. Um. You know, give something in return, I'm taking the wood. And that might seem silly to some people, but, you know, I think it's just on my conscience. So, fun fact, you don't actually have to stop at that first platform there in order to get back alive. Um, as you can see, I did just make that. It's very close, but you do not have to. So, there we go. And we're on 4 minutes 11 seconds right now. Um, I'll probably take one or two of these pieces back with me. Um, just to prove that you can do it in such a short time and so many people are so frustrated that they keep dying while trying to do this there this is this I as, le, the, the, let me try that again at least this is the most simple way that I have found that you can get yellow wood um, obviously I found another way that you can do it um, which I sort of like had an idea when me and code were going to get end times wood when you go down uh, on the end times bridge, um, you can go ahead and uh, drop the yellow wood onto the onto the end times, onto the bridge. I really can't get my words out today. Onto the end times bridge. Now there's someone over at that island over there, and I don't know if that's Cam or not. Cam, is that you? Oh my life! Has someone followed you? Oh, but I'm oh, I'm doing a video. <laughs> Okay, right. So, everybody just decided to come in. <laughs> okay, so your wall glitch up the side here, and if you didn't know how I did that, you just click on the wood, walk on top of it, and drag upwards, and it will take you up the wall. Um, just like Cam drives me up the wall. <laughs> I'm so funny. No, you're welcome. Um, you died, wow. Well, you can watch this video that I'm releasing tomorrow to find out how not to die. Um, no, no, you see, I'm always thinking of you. <laughs> and then exactly the same up this wall here, or fall, like I just did. Um, so drag upwards. This is a bit, this is awkward. Right, again, drag upwards, there we go. It's easy once you get the hang of it. We're on 6 minutes 10 seconds, and we're going to take this back over to my base, and we're going to go ahead and mill it, and then that will, should lead us up to 7 minutes, or just under, so we shall see. And of course, I haven't had any help or anything from um, anyone else in this game. In fact, Cam tried to block me off, not intentionally. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is by far the easiest way that I have found to get yellow wood in the quickest time. And of course you can bring as many pieces over as you want to and then come and do it. I'm only bringing one because you can see I sort of have enough already. And we're going to go ahead and drop that into here. Stop the timer. 6 minutes 53 seconds and 80... No, what? 6 minutes 8... Oh my life. 6 minutes 53 seconds. I can't speak. Thanks Cam. Great acting there. Um... That's really weird. I just looked over there and there's another one of me looking at me. That was cool. Oh, blimey. No, that's giving me the shivers. I don't like that. Because he's really pale as well, so I thought it was like a ghost. Okay, here you are. We have yellow wood. Six minutes, 53 seconds. And I've put it in long plank form. You know, we're pushing the boat out a little today. So remember, if you want to see more content like this, you can go and check out the other content that I already have on my channel. Um, I released an axe video on how much you can sell every axe for in Lumber Tycoon 2. Um, thanks, Cam. Yeah, you know, this is a great outro because of you. You know, you've made this outro, so thanks for that. 
And obviously, remember to like, comment, subscribe down below, turn on notifications, you'll be kept updated with our latest videos. And until the next one, we'll see you then. Say bye, Cam. Yeah, man. <laughs>